Welcome to the wonderful world of digital badging. If you are new to badging, you're probably wondering what is a digital badge? Well, you know how scouts have to complete certain tasks to earn a merit badge? Well, digital badges are kind of like scout badges, but for adults. Badges support learning in new ways and in new spaces beyond the traditional classroom. Whether it's a skill you've mastered in a course, your current job skills training, or from skills you have mastered in your everyday life. A badge is not only a visual representation of a skill, it also has built-in information that we call metadata. The metadata contains information like the badge name, the badge description, the badge criteria or what the badge earner had to do to earn the badge, who the badge issuer is, what evidence is used to prove that the badge earner actually earned the badge, and when the badge was issued. Badges are about mastering skills. For example, say that Billy has just completed CAD 101 and 102, and he mastered all aspects of the courses. So not only does he earn credit for the courses, but he also earns the AutoCAD 2D badge for the specific skills and competencies that he mastered. Another example is Stephanie. Stephanie not only learned her skills from her courses, but she also learned them from her job experience and was able to use prior learning assessments to get credit for her training. After Stephanie mastered all of the skills needed and passed the NIMS Machining Level 1 test with a 90%, she was then eligible for the Machining Level 1 Mastery Badge. So now that Stephanie and Billy have earned their badges, how do they show them off? Well, what better place to show off their badges than on LinkedIn, Facebook, and Twitter? By showing off their badge, not only are they building an online portfolio, but they are also attracting potential employers. Since 80% of recruiters and employers use LinkedIn to find potential employees, we highly recommend that all badge earners use LinkedIn to show off their badges. Most badging platforms give you the option to link your badge directly to your LinkedIn profile. And once you do that, then all of your contacts and any potential employers and recruiters looking for that credential can find you. So now that you know a little bit more about badging, you're probably wondering where can you go to start earning a badge? Many of the Colorado Community Colleges are issuing badges for their machining, CAD, and technical math courses. There are also many e-learning sites on the web that are now issuing badges. So go out there and start earning your badge.